Hello! Currently 8.52 on a Wednesday morning and I have been awake since quarter past six because originally I was going to go on a little walk, trail walk, hike sort of thing and then I looked outside, the weather was terrible, it's windy, it's been raining all night. I was like, oh, let's not do that. This is what we're doing instead. Yay! I do have shorts on guys. Veggie my shorts. I do not have a single plan for this video, so we're just gonna see what happens. One thing I didn't realize until I moved out of my house is that I actually love cooking. I think I'm gonna make bacon and eggs. Do you ever get this when you're eating eggs and then all of a sudden you like remember you're eating eggs and suddenly you wanna vomit? That happens to me. And while I do this, I'm gonna put on some music. The music we're gonna be listening to today has to be, of course, Sabrina Weenie. The sun sets slow over fields of gold. All the back roads where the stories unfold. Oh, pick up trucks, the dust in the breeze. Rolling through life as free as you please. Back road and bar stools, that's where I'll be. It's actually warm today. With a cold one in hand and my old guitar, you see. Singing about love and hard work in hands. Let's go to the shop. <laughs> One thing that I don't like about living in Melbourne is that if you want to go somewhere, there's going to be lots of cars. So we've come to the shops to run some errands. I don't even know if we say that in Australia, really, if that's just an American thing that we took on. I need to go to Kenlo's Warehouse, get some face wash, go to the shops, like go to Woolies. And I've like parked my car, reversed it back in, and now I don't have the energy to complete the rest of the task. Like, the thought of opening my door, walking in the wind to the shops, it's just really not for me right now. So guys, our goal of the day is for someone to ask me where I got my shirt from. So I can say, oh, actually, I made it myself. That's our goal. Guys, I did a freaking oopsie. Um, I thought I picked up the $30 serum. I think I picked up the $50 one. My car. Why did it stop moving when I was on the pedestrian crossing? Anyways, I need to check my receipt. Because <laughs> unless I did the maths wrong, which there's a very high chance I did the maths wrong. Lucky I have a job. Let's check this out. When she said the price, I was like, <sighs> let's see. Bum! I did. This serum, it was, it said $35 from where I picked it up from, but there was another box like the exact same on a different shelf that said $50. And I was like, well, I'll grab the $30 one. Bah! Now I'm gonna throw up. Usually I use this charcoal serum, but I was like, well, this is cheaper, so I'll just get this one. Ah! Crying and throwing up, that's what I'm doing. No bookshop for me today. And I'm only getting the essentials in Woolies because now we're poor. Well, we were poor before we went in. Why is life like this sometimes? But now we're only going to Woolies. I can park in the car park that's closer to Woolies. Let's get out of here. I hope we don't fall off. Ah! This road is like a thousand speed bumps, so you're most likely gonna fall off again. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I just spent that much money on a serum. <laughs> and watch it be really good. Watch me enjoy it, but never buy it again because why did I spend $50 on freaking serum? Do you guys get anxiety after buying stuff? Because literally, I think I'm low-key having sort of a panic right now. Because I, like, why am I hand shaking? <laughs> why did I just spend so much money on a serum by accident? I get paid tonight, so it's like not the end of the world, but kind of is the end of the world because why did I do that? Yes. I could have gone and back and returned it, but also look at this jelly mask I got. I'm gonna test that out tonight. 
I'm literally crying and throwing up. Ah! I went in there to get my face wash though. This is the face wash I use, guys. ASMR. Also, I left my necklace at home and I feel so naked without it because I play with it all the time when I'm anxious and I'm like, I literally am just gonna like, oh my gosh, I can't. Maybe I need to call my mom and tell her about this. Guys, it's freaking mango season. Look at this. One time at work, they brought in a green mango and you just slice it up and eat it and it was so good. But I like these. What in the that? Uh, guys, I got big hands. Look at that. Whoa. <laughs> my well famous smoothie recipe whoa why is this why is the banana not breaking what the what the actual <laughs> oh it's crunchy The way my camera was angled at the kitchen bench and not the smoothie. All right, I've officially hit the point where I put a weird comfy outfit on. I got my Ed Sheeran to a t-shirt thing. I've got Christmas pajama shorts on and my kangaroo sock. I'm trying to get a stain out of a shirt and not just any shirt. My Harry Styles tour, Harry's house shirt. You can't see it because it's inside out. But I was cooking a roast for my family the last day I was home and I was wearing this shirt and I leant forward and you can't see it that much now but right there chicken grease chicken grease on my Harry Styles shirt so yesterday I put stain remover on it a couple times washed it forgot I washed it found it in the washing machine this morning thought oh the stain's still there. So we're trying again to get the stain out. I'm using the Vanish, this stuff. It says uh, roof stain on the first try and I've used it a couple times now. I'll tell you what, never does. I don't think it's ever even completely removed the stain, but it helps. I just opened the serum that I bought and look. What? It comes with like the dropper separate to the actual thing. This is how small it is. And I spent, I don't even want to say it again. Hello, I've devised a plan guys. I've decided we're going to McDonald's and I've got cash. So it's free. It's going to be free. It's gonna be free. I just decided, I was like, oh, I could go for a walk, but honestly, I really don't feel like it. And I know that, like, I'm not, like, when I don't feel like going for a walk, if I force myself to, I'm gonna have the worst time. So I've decided I'm gonna get a little treat. Let's go. Get in there. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> We're about to drive. Didn't bring my lip balm. Didn't go to the toilet before I left. I'm a mess. But anyways, but let's go. Oh, took that a bit quick. I always find it so satisfying watching people drive. Oh, I gotta bring my bin in. Got emptied this morning. Hold on tight, guys. <laughs> this is so fun. I feel like I'm driving with a friend. But I am the friend, me. Me and myself and I. 
Why am I actually nervous to do anything in Melbourne? Here we go. Window down. Hi, we're in the app today. Uh, no, I'm not. What can I get for you? Can I please get a medium coffee frappe and an Oreo McFlurry? Yep, give me one minute. Yep, medium coffee frappe and Oreo McFlurry. Anything else for today? That's all, thank you. Okay, thank you. Let's chat with Um, guys, he sounds cute. He sounds cute. Sorry, the frappe and the McFlurry? Yes, um, with cash if that's alright. That's okay, 10.05. Yeah. That's 9.95. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. Yep. Bye. Guys, he was literally like 17, I think. I take back my comment. There you are. Thank you. Thank you. So yeah, I take back that I thought the guy was cute because I think he was 17. Why is my life like this? I'm just gonna see you at home because I'm kind of stressed out. I have anxiety. Hey guys, welcome to my McDonald's taste test. Here's my McFlurry. Nice amount of Oreos on the top there. Ooh, I got a you know thing. <gasps> Instant win. Got a train station. Here's my frappe. Oh. Oh wait, why am I using a paper straw? I'm at my house. Mm. She was a bit melted. Uh, but it tastes fantastic. 10 out of 10. Ice cream. Ooh, a bit cold. It was worth it. with this lid because this just feels like a waste of plastic but uh i'm gonna have a shower wash my hair before i do the serum and that i'm gonna put that face mask on it's in the fridge right now so it's nice and cold i'm like at negative one energy right now i'm sorry guys <laughs> 